Alright, what's up everybody? It's Dante Fido here. And I'm bringing you guys some Dark Souls Prepare to Die Edition gameplay. Why? Because I finally managed to figure out how to get the Durante DS fits to work and get the game going to full screen mode, so I've been spending my whole day off playing this. And yeah, this is kind of late, sort of, in the game. I'm... I, like, grinded a lot earlier with the dragon and the other guys, so I'm actually level 48 in this game. My covenant is I'm a forest hunter. I'll show you guys some forest hunter PvP in a little bit. Um, but yeah, I'm working on the Everlast Knight build, which is pretty cool. I honestly still... Let me move my mouse out of the way there. I really still don't know shit about this game. So... Um, I don't know. I'm just gonna run around here. I'm just gonna show you guys some stuff. And run around randomly, because there isn't really a set... I mean, there's stuff to do, but there isn't like, hey, you need to go do this. You can just kind of run around, explore, do your own thing. I know what I should be doing, but I don't have the master key to go to Blight Town, so I'm just going to run around and do other stuff instead for this video. Um, so, yeah, we're just going to run around here... guy's still alive. And now he's dead. I get his soul. Yay. I guess I should grab this. I'll need that shit for Blight Town anyway. Yeah, Lou. Coach the body. Thank you. Purple Moss Bomb. Very good. Whee! I'm now in Dark Root Garden. Yay. I cannot pass that off of here. Yep, there we go. And he's dead. That was kind of close. Whee! Alright, so I decided to go for like a super tanky build. And, uh, got all my po most of my points in strength and endurance, and vitality. Okay, that guy's gonna die. Yeah, he's dead. And this guy's gonna pop up right here. As soon as he pops up, kick him and kill him. And he's dead, alright. Whee! What's this thing? Eminent treasure. Eh. Close. Be wary of fall. Good idea. Good advice. Be wary of fall. We'll thumbs that up. It's a pretty good, pretty good point there. Good luck. Yeah. A bonfire right here. Let's go ahead and mess with this bonfire. Um, let me show you guys my gear real quick here, just to show you. So I'm using the Drake Sword with the longbow plus two. Went ahead and upgraded it. It's pretty easy to upgrade your gear here in this game. The hard part is getting it to be really, really good. That requires a lot of souls. I'm using the Hollow Soldier Shield plus two, and then the entire Elite Knight set plus two here. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to put on the Cat Covenant Ring so that I can PvP now. Basically, if anyone goes through this door and tries to fight in here, it means they're going to be messing with my boys, and we're going to have ourselves a fight. So I'm honestly, I think I leveled up way, I grinded levels way farther than I should be, and I've still got really new gear for being a high level. Um, so I've noticed, like, I fight people and I get my ass completely handed to me every single time. In fact, the only way I've actually been able to kill anybody is if they've been AFK. And gotten free loot and shit. So these guys normally right here... These guys would normally attack you, but because I'm a member of the Forest Hunters, I can actually talk to them, which is pretty cool. Don't worry now. You'll be called in soon enough. Hunters with patience score the best kills. Yeah. So normally, this is honestly an awesome spot to grind. You can kill, if you kill that dude, and then, where's the other guy? You kill this guy, and then there's a shadow, um, a phantom, yeah, this dude right here, this phantom guy. Um, and then you kill this mage dude who's right here. You kill all of these guys, let's see, that's 2,000, 2,000... 2,000, 1,000, that's 7,000, and it honestly takes 
you get a grand total of 7,000 souls for killing all these guys, and it takes like five minutes. And then you can run back over to the bonfire that's right outside here, restart it all, and do it again. Which I may end up doing, actually, because I'm kind of low on souls, and I really need to upgrade my gear. Oh, oh, there we go, PvP time. Um, if you invade a world as a regular dart spirit, because I'm hollow right now, um... I believe you're red. When you PvP here, as a Covenant, you become Dark Blue. And I have invaded the world of Big Boss Man 47. Let's do it, Big Boss Man. Let's go, dude. Let's go, dog. What you got? What you got? What you got? What you got? I want to bow to him, but I don't think he's going to let me. I think he's going to attack me first. Yeah, see, this guy looks like he's in freaking homo gear, maybe? Or ha haven? Hovel? Hovel? Havel? There we go. Now we got honorable combat. All right, let's go. Let's do this. I think he's going to kick my ass. Yeah, he looks like he's in ha uh, Havel gear. And which is way better than my elite knight armor. So I'm pretty sure he's gonna wreck my shit. I don't know. Ooh, that was close. Oh man, he hits hard. Oh Jesus. Oh man, yeah, I think I'm done for his sword. Oh yeah, he just like straight sliced my head off practically. Yeah, he looks like he's in um gear because he's a fat ass. Could be wrong though. Your phantom was dangerous for running into your world. That's kind of a cool thing about this is being uh when I decide to defend my own uh territory here is what this is. I guess I technically this covenant owns the dark um the dark root garden. So these guys are my whole job is to protect the dark root garden. So whenever someone enters this area, that's when I enter PvP mode. And I invade someone else's world. And that's cool because you don't need humanity to do that. You just gotta put the rain on and then boom, you're summoned and you can start PvPing. Normally in order to enter other people's worlds, you gotta go humanity and become human so you're not hollow anymore. And you can only do that so many times. You get I think I can do it four times right now, but if I put the rain on and I just stay in this area, then I can PvP as much as I want, basically. And yeah. So that's kind of the cool thing about this. Is if I want, I can just chill here actually and PvP as much as I want. And, um... I really need to go chill. I need to, like, go to Blight Town. I need to kill Quahog or whoever that bitch's name is. The spider chick. So I can get, um... Where's my thing at? I mean, see, I've got a... What's it? Yeah, I've got a Longsword plus three. And I think I need to get it to plus five first before I can turn it... Uh, I can use a Divine Spirit on it to turn it into, like, a Super Sword, basically. And now I get to invade somebody else's world, so we'll fight this guy and let's see what we got. I'm so bad at this game. Here we go. The Great Achilles! I've invaded the world of the Great Achilles. And here's the thing, too, is this This is kind of what I want to actually do, because I'm not... My guy isn't that powerful, because my gear sucks. Gear is so, like, a major factor of this game. Um, if I wait here long enough, maybe, and somebody else is trying to PvP, I actually did this earlier, somebody else entered the game. Oh, shit, he's summoning... I think he's someone summoning someone else to help him. But I've had it before where it's like, oh, Dart's, uh, Dart Spirit has entered this world as well, and there were two of us, there were two blue guys, there was me and another dude, and we double-teamed this guy earlier and just wrecked his shit. But now I think he called in help, so now I'll be in a 2 versus one So I think I'm kind of screwed here. I probably didn't stand a chance to get this against this guy to begin with, but... I guess we'll see. I don't know. Whee! I'm not sure where he's at. Where did he go? It's like super freaking easy to see me. I'm a big glowing blue thing. Here's a phantom. Not a phantom, but just a guy. His partner should be easy to see, because his partner should be solid white. Which isn't too bad. But he's just a regular normal color, and it's pretty hard to see where he's at in this 
vastly colored forest. I'm not sure where he went. I'm just running around here trying to get my ass kicked. Um, but yeah, these guys are humans, and I can in, uh, invade the world as hollows, which is pretty cool. So, I mean, if I kill them, they lose their humanity, and I get a special bonus item for defending uh, the territory here. Last time I got... Oh, shit. Is that him? No, it's not. Him. Last time I got a... Uh, let me see. Watch me get, like, jacked here. I don't know where it's at. There it is. Okay. I got a blue Titanite chunk last time for Tate for uh, invading someone's world and kicking their ass, which is pretty cool. As far as I know, that's pretty valuable. Looks like he's trying to summon another ransom into the world to assist him here. Oh, there he is. Oh, I think that's him. Oh, no, should we just try to? Oh, he's ready. He's ready for this. Honor old combat, good sir. Very nice. Alright. Honorable combat. Let's do it. I'm not sure what he's doing. Oh shit. Oh, what is that? Oh, what? It's got like some super. Oh shit. Oh wow. I think he put a lightning on his sword, maybe. He used gold rasping. Oh god, this is gonna hurt. Oh jeez. Well, that took out like half my stamina. Jeez. Oh man, yeah, I think he put like a super powered gold uh gold thing on his sword to kick my ass. Need a head. <laughs> well, rating of five. Those messages always make me laugh. Let's go ahead and give that a thumbs up. <laughs> Oops, didn't do that, but what else? There you go. Um, yeah, so. Uh, let's see here. What did I want to do? Oh, yeah, I want to show you guys. Um, He's got a, um, where's it at? Gold Pine Resin adds lightning, applies lightning to a right hand weapon. I'm pretty sure he did like a super one of those and just like completely demolished my ass. It's, it only lasts for a short period of time though. It only lasts like a couple, I think it's like 60 seconds is what I heard. Not sure. So, um, I got an idea. Let's show you guys the Hydra. Go ahead and backtrack my way out of here, and we'll, we'll check out the hydra. Let's do let's do one more PvP fight, and then I'll show you guys the hydra. We'll do three times the charm here for me getting my ass kicked. Be wary of knights. Yeah, the knight is only here once. If you kill him once, you get three thousand souls, and then he doesn't show up again. So he's replaced by that shadow phantom uh, phantom thief guy that I showed you guys earlier. Yeah, this dude right here. It was way easier to kill than the knight. But the knight was a good fight. It's a good PvP fight. So. Actually, I suppose if I really wanted to, I could run by here. Yeah, why not? I'll, I'll show you guys kind of where, where I'm currently at and what I'm attempting to do. Praise the sun! I'll show you guys, um... Sif. Uh, the Great White Wolf Sif. And then I'll show you guys the Hydra. Who I don't stand any chance of beating either of those guys, I think. I don't know. I think I need to level up. Probably not, though, because I'm already a super high level. I think I need better gear is what I need. Oh, here's a thing. Here, I'll... Oops. Okay. I'll invade this world, and then I'll... I'll show you guys what's up! That right there is the path to go to Sith. Whose world am I in now? Seth Arrow. Looks like that's probably him over there. Yeah, that's him. Okay. Oh wow, he's got a cool looking sword. I don't know. 
Oh, he doesn't want to bow? You just want to go at it? Alright, that's cool. Oh, wow, he's got bleed on that. That's cool, that's cool. Damn! Jesus. Yeah, I just got pwned. Yeah. See, I clearly need some better gear, because all these guys I'm fighting are using, like... They're all supposed to be around my level, which is level 50, and they're using, like, super crazy powerful weapons, so... Take off the cat ring so I don't get into any more fights here. Wait, I switched that out, didn't I? Yeah, okay, I did. Alright, so I'll show you guys the Hydra first, and then I'll go and I'll show you guys Sif. No, no, I don't really care if I lose my soul, I've only got 600, it doesn't really matter. Oh, he did that move. I hate that move. That move hurts. That works. Take it. <laughs> right, so we're gonna go this way instead. Path ahead. No kidding. Oh, oh, I don't think that's what I meant to do. Yeah, that was not what I meant to do. Shit. Uh, that was my bad on that one, guys. Give me a second. Shit, I knew he was going to do that move. I could see it, too. I don't know why I stood there and let him hit me. Yeah, it's hard to tell sometimes. I hate when I do that, too. That's a regular attack. And now he's dead. Oh, nice. My souls are right here. Cool. Oh, yeah. When you die, you get your souls back if you can go back. If you die twice in a row, uh, twice in a row though, you lose everything. So that's kind of an issue. Oh, ow, shit. Where the hell did he come from? That was gay. Okay, I'm switch to my Estus Blast so I can heal. I'm going to try to be careful as I run down here. Slow roll. Alright, yeah, see, so this takes me to Darkroot Basin, and this is where the Hydra's at. He's really mean. Eminent Secret, yeah, I don't know about that. Okay. Night ahead. Um, there's the crystal guys. I wouldn't exactly call those dudes knights, but whatever. Second here. Okay. Monster ahead. Yeah, that's about right. Monster ahead, yeah. Okay. Okay, so there's these Crystal Knight guys here. I think they're here. Yeah, I think that's one right there. Yeah, that's one of them right there. Okay. Yeah, these guys are easy to kill. Watch this. Basically, you're just going to run up here. 
I'm gonna switch to my bow. I'm gonna fire arrows at this guy. You can tell he's really not a big fan of that. I get 200 souls for that. Now some of you guys are like, wow, well, that's really cheap. And it is. But honestly, these guys aren't that hard to kill, so I'll go ahead and show you how you fight them. So let's draw this guy over here. Come on. Come on. Come at me. I think I remember how to fight yeah. Ooh, that's a new move. Ow. Okay, they're not they're not that hard to be on their own, but when you get a bunch of them together, then it's kind of a problem. And that's why I don't want to fight more than one. Let's see if we can't run up into this guy real quick. Actually, I'm almost. Alright, we're gonna run up over here again. Apparently they don't know how to climb. Which one's the angry guy? Okay, this guy's the angry guy. Okay, here. Let me just take this dude out with my bow. Shit. Just walking away. Give me one second. Alright, there we go. So now that I got it down to just one guy, I'll show you how to beat these dudes. In somewhat fair, honorable combat. Ow, that's kind of They go down pretty quick. My, uh... Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, yeah, that hurt. Ow, okay. Ow, 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 ow. Let me just back up. Oh man, I'm just gonna kick my ass. Maybe you can kind of see him there in the background. He's pretty tough to see right there. See that? Oh, you get! Oh, and I think he just wrecked my shit. Did he? Yeah, he did. See him? See him kind of right there? Yeah, that's his five heads shooting all that crap at me there. Okay, so now that puts us all the way back over here, and because I don't really care about getting my souls, I just want to show you guys some stuff. I will now show you... Um, it's pretty hard to get near that guy, so I guess you'll probably just have to go with that. Maybe I'll do a better video later of what the Hydra actually looks like. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys um, uh, great, uh, great, Giant Great Wolf Sif. It's pretty beast mode. Ow, that kind of hurt. Whee! Alright, give me one second here. Just gotta keep running through here. Praise the sun, yo. Be wary of boss. No kidding. Alright, we will traverse the white light. And I will show you guys. Great. Oh god, he's already here. Oh, Jesus. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I don't know why I hit that button. I was kind of done with it. Ooh, 
Ooh, yeah. So he's a giant wolf with a sword in his mouth. He's, he's pretty hardcore. He hurts a lot. Oh, jeez. There's this 360 move there. He jumps around a lot. He likes to jump around. goal here, from what I know, is you gotta get underneath him. And just kind of hit him like so, but he keeps running around. Kind of a pain in the ass. Oh, yeah, he did his 360 move and got me twice there. Oh, I think I'm dead. Ooh. Whoa, that was kind of lucky of me. Fucking potions. Alright, well, I'm all out of flasks now, so we'll see. Oh, wow, it did not block that successfully. Oh, jeez. Wow. So it's being pretty hardcore right now. He's a pretty pissed off wolf, I'm not gonna lie. Jeez. Bad, got some decent damage on him. Not bad, not bad. Just gotta watch out. He likes to move around, he likes to keep it real. Another attack. Doing alright, doing alright. Yeah, that's another swing back. Whoa, and that's a swing down, jeez. As I as I dodge that. There's a swing back. Okay. Another swing down. Yeesh. Oh wow, and he got me with that one, ouchie. Oh yep, there's a 360 and I didn't have enough stamina to block, so. I is dead. Alright, so here we are back here, and uh, yeah, that's currently what I'm in the process of doing, is trying to either defeat Sif, defeat the Hydra, and PvP kids. So, at some point I'll move on to Blight Town, and probably record the uh, Quihod fight whenever I manage to get there, but here's just some Dark Siders gameplay for you guys, That's or Dark Siders, Dark Souls. Can't wait for Dark Souls 2 to come out in March next year, it looks like it's going to be awesome. That's pretty much all I got, so until then... I will catch you guys later. I'm going to give you a wave here. Is there a wave? Is there a wave button? There is a wave. Alright, there it is. Catch you guys later, and peace. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Woohoo!